published, 533 EDT, the 19th of June 2018, updated, 805 EDT, the 19th of June 2018 model Kelly Brook led the style stakes as she joined thousands of racegoers arriving for the first day of Royal Ascot on Tuesday, the five-day spectacle, the jewel in the crown of the racing season, kicked off this morning in a burst of pastel-colored summer frocks and flamboyant hats. Despite increased security measures at the gates, revelers appeared in excellent spirits as they descended on the Berkshire course in their dozens. More than 300,000 people are expected to attend this week. Football fan, Kelly Brook donned an England World Cup hat as she arrived for the start of the five-day racing spectacle Floral Fantasies, an enormous bloom was the perfect finishing touch to this look, making a statement in hot pink, right cheers. Racegoers started the celebrations early as they toasted to the start of the racing festival with glasses of bubbles red alert, Milinaril de Vico, center, hit the right note with one of the day's biggest style trends with her red hat rainbow dream, multicolored prints and retro hairstyles gave this group of women a playful 1940s feel muted tones, black and white polka dots, a rose printed frock. A chic powder pink number on designer Isabel Kristen settling in, buckets of sparking wine, crates of beer and bottles of spirits were on the go as racegoers arrived on Tuesday TV Queens, Kate Garraway looked stylish in a jumpsuit by Phase 8, right, Charlotte Hawkins in a dress by Susanna Classic Elegance, this group strode into the race course in pastel frocks, matching clutches and ladylike gloves touch of class. Model Lana Holloway in feathers, left, pink and red creations, center. A young woman in midnight blue getting the party started. It was already Pim's o'clock for some racegoers as they bought themselves a drink after arriving, turning up the glamour. Ella, model Angelina Carly, boutique owner Charlotte Elmy Britton, and two glamorous women in pastel, pretty in pastels, sherbet colored shares of pink. Yellow and purple were all on display as Royal Ascot attendees arrived editor of Hello, Rosie Nixon, L, and editor of OK. Chrissy Reeves, model Layla Romick, designer Isabel Christensen, right familiar face, horse racing pundit John McCrurick donned a vibrant waistcoat as he arrived at Ascot with his wife Jenny Extra Checks. Sniffer dogs were used at the entrance to the racecourse as security measures were stepped up for the event raising the stakes. A towering feathered hat is easily seen in the crowd, left, right, playful in pink and red say it with hats, socialite Gail Hayden Stapf chose pink, while others went for simple black, center, and bold designs, right, that's one way to make an entrance. Racegoers arrived by horse and carriage for the first day of the racing spectacle floral print, modest hemlines and eye-catching hats were the order of the day for many, while a more relaxed dress code for the Windsor enclosure means strapless dresses were on show for the first time. However eagle-eyed organizers were on the lookout for men daring to step in without socks, an increasingly popular trend that has been banned from this year's event. Civilized affair, well heeled racegoers sat down at picnic tables with bottles of bubbly as they settled in for a day of fun. Elegant arrivals, Lizzie Cundy, left, opted for an off the shoulder white frock, right, fashion editor Flora Johnston. Ladies in red, breathtaking evening gowns in shades of red and pink perfectly complemented each other, setting up boxes of Corona. Fosters and Heineken men tracegoers had plenty of choice when it came to beer wearable art. From delicate fascinators, left, to bird cages, center, and full on flowers, right, the hats certainly stole the show popping bottles, champagne was on the go in the Bollinger tent as three dapper gentlemen shared a toast quirky touches, former glamour model Jackie St. Clair, left and soprano and Ascot ambassador Natalie Rushdie strike a pose. The model beamed as she showcased her red and white hat, which she wore with an off-the-shoulder dress bold and beautiful, a teal satin. Frock and over-the-top hat made sure this woman stood out from the crowd at Ascot Here Come the Girls. The five-day racing spectacle gives racegoers the chance to show off some of their best looks polished presenters, Kate Garraway, left. 
and Charlotte Hawkins, Wright, were among the stars at day one of Royal Ascot Delicate Design, this complicated floral hat is made up of tiny white blooms interspersed with leaves on rings of twigs flower power. Flowers featured on dozens of different hats, either as added details, left, or as the entire look. Right fabulous, red nails and a strong red lip added to the drama of this bold black and white look at the entrance to Ascot monochrome or bold colors. Both were big hat trends at Ascot this year, with women looking to outdo each other fabulous in feathers, more is more when it comes to this outrageous creation, paired perfectly with sparkly sunglasses girls day out. A group of glamorous women stole the show in elegant summer dresses and chic skirt and blouse combos finishing touches, Cassandra Hudson straightens Henry Wisey Becker's tie as they make their way into the race course pink petals, hats, left, dresses and shoes, right, were all adorned with flowers as women got into the spirit of summer day out, groups of friends dressed to the nines as they arrived for the start of the action at the Berkshire Racecourse classic combinations, white and red, left, and white and black, right, gave these women sleek looks for the five-day event last once over. This group of girlfriends helped each other on with their candy-colored hats just moments before entering, and it's showtime. Moments later the women were ready to make their entrance in their carefully coordinated looks picnic with Prosecco, smiles across their faces, these women looked ready for the day with their glasses of bubbles pink perfection, whether it was the palest shade, left, or floral touches, right, pink was a popular color choice splash of color. Retro Girl Band The Tootsie Rollers coordinated in bright primary colors and rainbow metallic high class picnic, with pot plants, a champagne bar and solid wood furniture, this enclosure remained the picture of class race goers faced breathalyzer tests and a team of sniffer dogs at the gates as organizers seek to clamp down on antisocial behavior, there will also be a crackdown on beer sales and an increased stewarding presence. An ugly brawl broke out at a Saturday race meeting at the track in May, putting a spotlight on the increasing use of recreational drugs and excessive drinking at race courses. Sniffer dogs were also seen at work in the parade ring before the action got underway. Bright and beautiful, whether it was patterns, left, neutrals, center, or pop colors, right, women dressed to impress personal style, soft hues, left, bohemian inspired accessories, center, and bold color combinations caused a stir, clash of color, yellows, pinks and patterned florals were all on display as a group of friends enjoyed a glass of bubbles true blue, Melina Maria's hats over, left, paired blue with neutral, right. Presenter Francesca Cumani opted for all navy plenty to smile about, glass in hand and snacks at the ready. These women were certainly ready for a day at the races dapper, pinstriped shirts and brightly colored ties meant the men weren't left behind when it came to the style stakes making an entrance, coordinated couples, left, posed for selfies, right, as they made their way into the grounds glamorous, floral print. Modest hemlines and eye-catching hats were the order of the day for many dapper gentlemen, smartly dressed racegoers arrived for day one of Royal Ascot at the Berkshire Racecourse on Tuesday ready for the action, glamorous racegoers descended on Ascot train station in their dozens on Tuesday morning taking a break, comfortable rat and garden furniture gave guests a place to soak up the atmosphere daring to bear. A relaxed dress code in the Windsor enclosure means women can wear off the shoulder styles, pictured heightened security, police patrolled the gates as revellers arrived for the first day of the action at the Berkshire Racecourse bag search, even the smallest of handbags was examined by security staff as revellers made their way inside smile. This glamorous group of women stopped to snap a photo with the armed police officers on their way into Ascot Extra Checks, organizers have stepped up security at Ascot following a fight at a meet at the course last month taking a closer look, one man dressed in a morning suit looks down at the sniffer dog as he checks out the arrival's stringent, 
Sniffer dogs were present at the entrance to the race course and will also be positioned outside of the bathrooms. Security checks, police and dog handlers find a minute to chat during their patrols of the Berkshire race course. On Tuesday stricter security measures have been introduced as organizers seek to clamp down on antisocial behavior and Royal Ascot racegoers face breathalyzer tests and a team of sniffer dogs at the gates as organizers seek to clamp down on antisocial behavior. There will also be a crackdown on beer sales and an increased stewarding presence. An ugly brawl broke out at a Saturday race meeting at the track in May, putting a spotlight on the increasing use of recreational drugs and excessive drinking at race courses. One of the biggest changes that racegoers will notice at the Royal Meeting is the absence of beer hawkers, staff carrying beer on their backs to sell in the crowds. Other new measures in the Behaviour Errol Management Plan include an increase in the High Visibility Response Team to more than 100 stewards, and more specialist incident spotters. More than 20 sniffer dogs will also patrol the Berkshire course, which is expected to attract more than 300,000 people in the week. In an unprecedented move, the sniffer dogs will be seen near the toilets, in an effort to reduce recreational drug use.